Hey, welcome back to my channel everyone. Uh, today we got the newest edition from Walmart again, uh, part 2 I'm going to call it. Uh, the Hockey Mystery Boxes. So uh, last week I released a video with the gems of the game. It was uh, two boxes there, they are about $32 a piece and you ended up with 10 hobby packs. Here they have the, they brought back the Hockey Mystery Boxes where you get one mystery item and four factory seal packs. These were $15.99 a pack, or a box. Uh, at Walmart and uh, let's do a comparison see what we got here yeah so they show the McDavid series one pack here they show the Matthew series one they also show the Besser series one plus they, they love showing these uh, black diamond packs on here which I guarantee you're not gonna get yeah. come on Packs first, and let's see the uh, mystery items for later. Okay. So we ended up with a 1516 Series 2 pack, 1718 Series 1 pack, a 1718 CHL pack, and a 1617 Series 1 pack. I'm going to say right now, just based on the value of the, the cards here, this is a much better value to get than the Gems of the Game one. Because basically I got these same packs in the gems of the game, but paid double the price. And the greater card that you got out of there definitely was not worth the effort. Let's see what else we got here. So in pack two, yeah, so we got another 16, 17 series one. We got another 15, 16 series two. Uh, MVP 1718 and 1718 Series 1 again. So, again, still not too bad. And the third box. Again, a 1617, 1718, a Leaf Centennial, and a 1718 Series 1. So, for the two boxes, I know I bought purchased three of them here, but comparing two boxes alone, you are definitely better off buying two of these ones than you are buying uh, buying the uh, Gems of the Game one. Because there's no way you're going to get the McDavid graded card or the Crosby graded card or anything like that out of your box. Whoever does is going to be happy, assuming there is one. But other than that, no one else is. So let's begin here. Let's start with the 1718 CHL Hockey. Never did open up any of these packages, so we'll see what we get out of here. It's a thick one. Oh, a lot of cards. Cedric Perret, Vince Lachiavau, Mitchell Balmas, Jake LeCision, Carson McKinnon, Tyler Soy, Adam Thalander, Nicholas Camano. So I believe he's... Nick Camano, I think he's with the... Uh, uh, was Dallas, not Dallas Stars, Minnesota. Oh, Dallas Stars, yeah, I think so. Uh, Jacob Paquette, the top prospects. Jordan Hallett, Samuel Dub McFells, and Jordy Stollard. So, unfortunately, I don't know any of these uh, guys in there other than maybe the Nick Commando card. Let's go with the 17 or the uh, Charles Maple Leaf Centennial set. Let's see what we get out of this. Russ Cortnell. Ed Belfour, Dion Phaneuf, a die cut of Daryl Sittler, a decoy, and a Errol Thompson. Let's go with the MVP. Yeah, definitely based on the packs, we're better off buying these mystery hobby boxes than the other ones. Patrick Berglund, Cam Ward, Ryan Strom, a Cam Talbot, facsimile auto, Alec Martinez, Corey Perry, Gus of Nyquist and Andrew Ladd. Okay, why don't we start with the 1718 series one, see if we can get a young gun out of here. At least out of here, we ended up getting six, seven, eight, nine, nine upper deck uh, series one, series two packs. So that's always nice. Darren Elm, Richard Raquel, Arturi Lekkonen, Colton Sevier, Brian Hartman, Casey Ziz. Sizikas, 
Tyler Sagan, and Alex Killorn. So unfortunately, just the base back. Next one. Jeff Petrie, Jack Eichel, uh, Michael Matheson, Michael Forleek, and looks like a Shining Stars here, if I'm going to guess. Yeah. Michael Granlin, Shining Star, Mike Hoffman, Matthew Kachuk, and Patrick Maroon. Our last one from 1718. Dion Phaneuf, Andre Sekera, Jared Spurgeon, a canvas of Austin Matthews, Zadino Chara, Mitch Marner, Braden Holpe, and Patrick Bergland. So, let's move on to 1718 Series 2. Maybe we can get the uh, Eichel rookie or <clears throat> possibly a Connor McDavid canvas. We got Mike Hoffman, Andre Burkowski, Craig Smith, and an OPG update of Dougie Hamilton, Roman Yossi, Jonathan Bernier, Anders Lee, Jason Spezza. Have you yet to get one young gun? Here's hoping. Neil Yakupov, a Mark Stone, Brad Richards, Justin Fontaine, and a retro rookie of Dylan DeMello, regular back, Phil Kessel, uh, Mark Zidlicki, and Brad Conley. And the last one from 1516 Series 2. Banner Kane, oh. Neil Yakupov, Mark Stone again, Brad Richards again. Oh, hey, not a bad one. Young Gun Canvas, Jared Sparks, or Garrett Sparks, pardon me. At least got something out of there. Martin Jones. Come on. A Tyler Toffoli, and a Sam Gagne. And our last three packs here from the 16-17 Series 1. Maybe got a Marner, Liney Canvas, a Matthews, Young Gun. Let's see, that looks like a jersey card. Daniel Girardi, Jonathan Quick, and a jersey of uh, Derek Stepan. Ryan Johansson, Matt Molson, and Nathan Billy. Okay. Trevor Daly, Brooks Locke, Tobias Enstrom, Checklist, and a Shining Stars of Philippe Forsberg, Kyle Clifford, Leon Dreisaitl, and Francois Beauchemin. And our last pack. Uh, Ryan Kessler, Matthias Eckholm, Robbie Fabry, Devin Dubnik, and... No. Nope. Calvin DeHaan, Kyle Clifford, Andre Seidel, and Francois Boschman. So again, base back there. So even though nothing came really spectacular out of the packs, it's definitely a better value anyways. And now let's see what we get for our update cards here, our mystery cards. So this one is a Steven Samko's canvas. <laughs> and that looks like the 1314 or 1415 design. That Boy, for a mystery card, that is definitely a letdown. Nothing special about that card whatsoever. Let's see, our second one. Feels like a, well, at least it's a young gun. Uh, Matt Fratton for the Maple Leafs. What is that? 08. Oh, sorry. No, 11, 12. Young gun. At least it's a young gun. And our last one is a... Oh, geez, our special one here. These Luke Coonan uh, Top Rookies Gold Edition that they used to throw into all the individual boxes that they package so your mystery cards are kind of useless come out of there but at least the packs are worth it so give you a quick recap of what we got out of these three uh hanger boxes anyways uh fleet porsberg shining stars Derek Stepan jersey probably the best card here garrett sparks young guns canvas probably about a two dollar card dylan DeMello, opg update doug hamilton opg update uh canvas of austin matthews a shining stars michael granlin a facsimile auto Cam Talbot, a die cut of Daryl Sittler, top prospects of Jacob Paquette, a Steven Stamkos canvas, a Matt Fratton young gun, 
Andy Luke Coonan, top rookie. So there you have it. Those That's what you can expect inside one of these ones here. Again, and whoever pulls a black diamond or a UD black pack, I'm sure will be happy, assuming they even get it. But, you know, yeah, I think this is definitely a better value, though. At least you got a shot at getting something good and like the uh, Gems of the Game packs. But let me know what you think. See uh, which ones you prefer there. So uh, if you like what you see, uh, please like and subscribe. And until next time, uh, thanks for watching. Take care.